without further ado, let me now zoom into the details of this season's away kit. Uh, and I would just like to show you guys some close-ups. And I hope you guys can sit back and enjoy looking at these shirts together with me. And starting off with uh, some names on the back of these shirts, just showing you how it looks and me looking really happy right there. And uh, just a closer look on how I look wearing the shirt. And there's our stars wearing this shirt and they're rocking it really. And you can see Smith Rowe out injured this season so far. Ben White wearing them proud. You have Saka, our star boy as well, rocking it. And Tommy Yasu looking sharp. And our captain, Martin Erdegaard. You know, and this shirt came from UK, you know, direct from Arsenal itself. You can see I'm zooming in on the collars for you to see. It is a round neck collar. Simple. And I think this is a nice enough touch for this shirt. You know, with a, a, sh a shade of grey as well on the back of the collar. And I think overall it's a nice mix of colours here. Black and grey. And uh, made in Georgia. I think I got myself an S size. And you can see right here, I'm focusing on the cannon for you. This is actually in place of the club badge that will usually be here. But I think this is a much nicer touch with the cannon right here being uh, sewn on. I'm zooming a little closer for you to have a look. Um, gold cannon with black outline uh, all sewn in. And this is a very beautiful uh, way to put on a jersey. And well done and props to Adidas for making beautiful shirts for us the past few years. And long may the partnership continues between Arsenal and Adidas. And right splashed across the front of the shirt, you can see the Emirates Fly Better, our club sponsor. And those are in black and gold. Beautiful, in my opinion. And right here, moving fast to the sleeves. And this cuff uh, uh, is actually rubberized and uh, it does uh, close in nicely on your arms. It's a good fit for you. Uh, hopefully, if you get uh, one uh, for yourself, you will be able to feel it. And the texture is kind of nice with a shoulder uh, Adidas, the usual three stripes going down from the collar all the way down to the uh, sleeves. And in this case, you can see that this is in a shade of grey that is just nice, you know, a light shade and arrow ready uh, technology that helps with uh, cooling if you wear this you know to play football or any sports you won't really feel the heat as much helps to dissipate the heat and stuff like that and AFC right here is where I'm focusing on the prints and the shirts are beautiful you know the intricate details around this AFC you know logo it's a nice touch to the jersey and uh, gives it a nice uh, feeling about the whole uh, shirt making it look a little bit more sophisticated than just being plain black and over here just showing you guys the labels uh, of the shirt with the uh, official licensed product sticker that uh, shows the authenticity of the shirt and I've got this fan version jersey so you can definitely see that this is not the player worn version but this is the fan version which I much prefer because everything is sewn on uh, and you can see the Visit Rwanda uh, sleeve sponsor as well in Go. Um, heat pressed in this case but the club logo the adidas logo as well they are all sewn on and this only comes with the fan version of the shirt i think even for the player version of the shirt uh, most of the things are actually you know heat pressed on um, which my personal preference is for things to be sewn and therefore this fan version jersey is arguably uh, better in my opinion in terms of durability and here I'm actually wearing a Martinelli a shirt. You can see me and uh, Erdegaard as well. Just zooming in for you guys to see the um, heat pressed prints at the back of the shirts. Uh, this came direct from Arsenal as I was saying earlier. And this is uh, done by Arsenal itself. Which I find it to be truly the only authentic way to get these um, uh, gold names, uh, gold heat press names on the back of the shirt. Because there are too many fakes out there. You know, um, and you can't discern between what's real or not. And the cost of these uh, uh, go names and uh, letterings are way too expensive from 
the other you know websites that I've came across. So you know, buying from Arsenal Direct to me is the best way to get these shirts, and it's definitely authentic, one hundred percent. So I'm panning around for you guys to have a closer look around these shirts, Saka, uh, Jesus, and Tomiyasu shirts hanged right here in uh, my cabinet. <laughs> And here you have the back of me wearing uh, Saka and Jesus right here with the number 9 and uh, Tommy Yasu as well um, had to fight for his place with Jin Senko and I think that it's a healthy competition for us it's a happy thing you know, just zooming in a little bit on the front of the shirt again for you guys to have a closer look um, the Adidas, the Gold Cannon and uh, Emirates Fly Better looking really sharp on the shirt front and me with my smile again wearing this shirt S size fan version and this um, portion here I would like to bring your attention uh, to the three stripes down the uh, shoulder this is going down much longer than the usual uh, three stripe shoulders so I like that because going down the shoulder longer does make your shoulder looks broader you can see that these are both S size shirts uh, from the previous season um, and the current season both S size that I wear and both the fan version um, shirts, but you can see the shoulder stripes are going much shorter for last season's and usual jerseys that Arsenal Adidas had and this season's one the three stripes go way longer and that gives uh, us you know a broader shoulder look and I love that especially and that's really all I have to share with you guys I hope you guys enjoyed looking at the shirt as much as I did hope you guys get your hands on one and with that I hope you guys stay well, take care, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you and bye-bye.